Well guys, welcome back to Max Reaction. How are you doing today? How are you doing today? Hopefully you're doing great. We're going to react to top 10 shocking facts about the Philippines, Philippine facts, and history. And this is the 2017 version. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. Absolutely love the Philippines. I have the soft, soft spark. Soft, soft spark. Soft, soft spot for the Philippines. Because I'm married to a Filipino, for one, and I absolutely just love the Filipino people. Let's check it out. The Earl of the Orient, a collection of more than 7,000 beautiful islands. Lots of islands to explore. Has been continuously sculptured by Mother Look Nature how beautiful it is. Stronger countries. Ah. Explored by Magellan in 1521, and named in honor of Prince Philip, the Spanish held the islands for 300 years. I didn't know that. That's why it was named that. In 1899. This is the Cool Fact Show. Subscribe for more. Named facts. after Prince Philip. The Philippines was explored by the Portuguese and claimed by the Spanish before being ceded to the U.S. in 1899. The U.S. officially abandoned claims to the country in 1991. The Philippines is an old country with a long and rich history, but not many people know that the largest naval battle in history was fought in the Philippine Sea. I knew that already. The World War II. The Philippine Sea holds the record for the largest naval battle in history. The Battle of the Philippine Sea was a standoff between that was, the U.S. Navy that's and the amazingly scary. Considered oh. the largest aircraft carrier battle, it involved 1,700 aircrafts and 170 other warships. That's amazing. The largest single Navy formation in history. The Philippines is an archipelago resting nearly 500 kilometers from Southeast Asia. Only about 7% of the islands in this massive stretch are larger than one square mile, making the population concentrate on the larger islands where dense cities can be found. The Look at that. Most wow. densely populated cities in the world are found in Metro Manila. Manila, the country's capital, boasts a population of more than one. I've only spent a little bit of time in Manila. Manila's population density is approximately 42,857 people per square kilometer, or 43 people per square meter. A whole lot of people. The densely populated city is Pateros, with a total population of 64,147, and Caloocan is third, with a total population of 1,489,000. That is a whole, whole lot of people. With such a high population, it is no wonder that of the 10 largest shopping malls in the world, three are in the Philippines. As a cultural trend, I haven't gotten a chance to go to any of those three yet. Malls are so large, they encompass I've been to the one in Cebu, the though. Retail area of 1,396,000. 275 square meters or 15 million 29 oh my gosh square feet. whoa though the overpopulation and population density inevitably leads to increased crime rates the crime rate throughout the entire country drops to near zero during Manny Pacquiao's boxing matches during the love last Manny Pacquiao like I would say Manila, man there was no crime reported at all in Metro Manila I wish he would have won the size of the islands range dramatically within the Philippines and Camiguin is one of the smallest despite being the smallest 23 by 14 kilometers it has more volcanoes than towns. The largest oh my gosh, more volcanoes than towns. Located in the island of Luzon, Luzon, approximately 55 miles northwest of Manila. In 1991, the eruption emitted around 10 million tons of magma and dropped the global 10 million by tons. The Philippines boasts some of the biggest things of all countries, so it's no wonder that the largest known pearls were found yeah, in the Yeah, I heard about that. Palau is the largest known in the world and weighs approximately 14 pounds. The Palawan Princess... Wasn't there one found in some... under some pounds. fisherman's bed or something? Do you have any interesting facts you would like the world to know? Share them in the comments below. Yeah! You, like this you should have mentioned the gold that was left. So Share this video with your friends and family. New videos are posted all the time. This is the cool fact. Anyway, they, sh they should have mentioned the World War II gold that was left. And um, wasn't there some guy that found some of it and then they the government take took it? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe I don't know my facts straight. Maybe you can clarify it. Comment down below. Wasn't there some guy that found... Uh, what's that guy's name from Japan? Like Yama something? I don't know. Anyway, what other facts could they show, and what kind of facts can you tell me? Because one day I may move there, me and my family. Um, I'm sure my wife would love to live back where her family is, but that's in the future. Anyway, I hope you like my reaction. If you did, and you want to continue watching reactions, I react to a lot of stuff, but I'm going to start reacting to more Filipino stuff as well. So uh, hit that subscribe button and the bell. Anyway, I'm going to drop this link down below. Check it out, and next time you... Uh, Want a re reaction? You should choose a max reaction because we're best in the world. Peace.